Hello, welcome to the Margin Odd Show, the cybersecurity show. The iOS 18 beta 2 has just been released, and in this video, I'm gonna cover all the new features you need to know. So without further ado, let's get right to it. We're going to our iOS 18 is currently available for developer beta testers with a public beta expected in July and a general release schedule for September. It's important to note that in its early beta stages, changes and improvements can be unpredictable. This means something functional in iOS 18 beta 1 might be broken in iOS 18 beta 2. So as always, proceed with caution. Additionally, the second beta of a major iOS update tends to be the least exciting because Apple hasn't had much time to address major concerns and feedback yet. In fact, iOS 18 beta 2 was likely compiled less than a week after the WWDC. iOS 18 beta 3 is likely to be a more interesting update with significant changes and features. So the iOS beta 2, new features and changes. Uh, the big change in iOS 18 beta 2 is that iPhone mirroring is now available. You'll need a Mac running Mac OS Sequoia beta 2. Then you can mirror your iPhone screen right on your Mac. This includes notifications, gestures for uh, navigation and more. Please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and the like button. Please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and the like button. So the iOS 18 beta 2 also adds support for new share play screen uh, sharing features, including the ability to take over and control the other person's screen. With iPadOS 18 Beta 2, Apple has expanded the changes it made in the European Union in response to the DMA to the iPad. This includes uh, alternative browser engine support, app marketplaces, and more. So the EU App Store changes for iPad now available to test with second iPad OS 18 Beta. There's a new dark mode version of the App Store icon. So in the settings app under messages there you know there's a new toggle for rcs messaging this seems to be enabled by default but rcs doesn't appear to actually be live yet in the passwords app there's a new plus icon in the bottom right corner for easily adding new login login information to the app previously this button was only in the all menu of the app okay so that's everything that you need to know regarding this please take a moment to hit that subscribe button and like button please take a moment to hit that subscribe button and like button right now come on don't don't hop off this video unless you hit that subscribe button guys the, the goal this year is 10,000 subs by the end of this year we gotta hit 10,000 subs uh and another thing Every Wednesday, 9 to 10 p.m., I am doing a live stream. So let me know some of the things that you guys want to have a live stream about in the comment section. I appreciate your viewership. Stay safe and see you on the next video.